Right, hi, and welcome back. Um, firstly, I just wanted to say thanks to everyone for tuning in. Um, I've had some great feedback from my first video diary entry, and um, I just want to say a quick hi and thanks to a few people. If I haven't mentioned you here and you're watching, thank you so much. I really appreciate that people are really interested and following this journey, so thank you so much to everybody. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to name a few people. So Mark, my husband, Sophie, Mum, Ellie Becker, Lisa, Faye Jones, Lee Bryan, Melissa Spence and Miriam Faz and everybody else. So, yeah, hi. Um, so, firstly, this is um, this detox is for everybody. Um, it's going to be really fun. Let's have fun with it. Um, so, yeah, share it with your friends. And um, if you've got any comments, questions, ideas, I really appreciate your input. So you can just add them at the um, bottom of the YouTube video or wherever. I'm sure I'll find them. So, um, yeah, just... just thanks and um, get involved basically so um i'm going to raise this point first because this is quite important actually i'm not a dietitian i'm not a um scientist or a doctor so if you're interested in doing this i recommend you get in the book or doing some research and there are ways to do this because um you know we are talking about budget along with practicality and feeding other people but um this book is second hand and i got it online for two pounds ten it came through the door um i didn't have to pay postage and it's in perfect condition i think there's like maybe a pencil mark somewhere in one of the recipes but that's it i mean two pounds ten and um yeah that's great i think i got like 20 percent off which worked out as about 40 pence or something i can't remember but yeah i mean that is a bargain isn't it um and i can always pass it on you know if i finish with it or lend it you know and that's a lot cheaper than some of the books that you're paying now 15 pounds whatever it is you know in wh smith so that's great so yeah go to the library there are ways to cut costs with actually buying the book and the information that you need to do this um and then i've got another little point i've got some feedback um this is a detox that I'm doing. So um, I'm different to everybody else. We're all individuals. We've all got different lifestyles. We all built differently. We all come in different shapes and sizes. So um, although I'm taking it quite seriously, if you're interested in doing this or just following my journey, then perhaps it's more of it's just a health kick for you or just a, a bit more awareness of your well-being or anything like that. So, um, so yeah, I just wanted to raise that because um, I will go into a bit more detail about myself and what I need in my life and, you know, and so forth. Because obviously I am cutting out a lot of stuff that I'm used to and, and that, can, that can be quite hard. Which actually brings me on to my next point because I'm just going to give you a quick update of where I am. This is day six now of my detox and um, it has been quite hard actually. Um, the first few days I had a really big caffeine withdrawal. Now I did just kind of go cold turkey with it and Carol in the book um, advises perhaps to wean yourself off a bit which I should have done perhaps in hindsight because I wouldn't have had such a severe headache. But it did quickly go and, and it, it was it wasn't um you know like it's, it's I knew about it from reading the advice that I would get that. Um and yeah it it was it was a really bad headache, but it did go pretty quickly and it didn't last. And the same with feeling um lethargic. I was feeling like that before the detox, which is one of the reasons why I wanted to do it, but I actually felt even more like I didn't have many energy for the first few days. And that was quite tough as well, because I want to get I'm I'm quite a lively person and bubbly and I like to do things, be on my feet and you know, that's quite challenging. But after that sort of um passed, I my, obviously the headache had gone and my energy levels really rose rapidly and I was doing things that you know perhaps I wouldn't have been able to do like little things the extras that perhaps you kind of neglect really so that's a really positive but it it I did have to kind of put in the work to get there because it you know the headache was pretty bad um now like I said the headache didn't last but yesterday which was Monday my first day back at work after the weekend um I got a bit more of a headache again. I think it's just from the routine of me being at work and I love a coffee at work and everything. And um, so, yeah, perhaps I think it was something to do with that, the computer screens and stuff. But again, it passed. I don't have a headache at all now whatsoever. So so that's good. Um, the other part to this as well um, that I wanted to update you on um, is that it, it's quite difficult adjusting. And um, in the book, um, obviously I've, I've read all the the information in the beginning and it's written really well um it's quite easy to digest 
digest. Um, uh, but there's also um, like an actual plan, like, you know, breakfast, dinner, lunch for each day of the week for the whole 28 days. Now, I haven't followed that strictly. Um, and I think I'm actually going to do that next week because at least have a plan. My plan I might sort of hybrid it between myself, my plan and, and Carol's um, just because um, it's good to have a bit of structure. I could find myself grazing a lot. Um, and, you know, it's nice to have the meal with my partner, um, my husband, Mark. And, um yeah, I think I need that structure in, in my diet. So, um, so yeah, that's re it really. That's the update for now. Um, there's more to come. And, um, yeah, I, I'm excited because, um, like I said at the beginning, this is going to go um, and reach a lot of people. And I'm really, really um, happy and grateful to be in this position. And I'm glad I made the decision. So it's all good so far. Um, I will give you some more... Um, updates on some certain things that I couldn't cover now I wanted to keep it um short you you know um I don't want to wrap it on forever I know I'd like to talk but um but yeah once again thanks everybody for your uh, support and do share and share and um I'll see you in a couple of days <laughs>